Hello Sunday, I didn't know Joseph. Yeah, again, the pastor of Success Dimension Church. This time around, I want to speak to you about joy. 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 The Bible says in the book of Philippians, chapter 4, verse 4, it says, Rejoice in the Lord. And again, I say unto you, Rejoice. Rejoice in the Lord. And again, I say unto you, Rejoice. The Lord wants you to rejoice. To rejoice means to respond to joy. The first thing I want you to know is that the Bible says in the presence of God there is fullness of joy. And at his right hand there are pleasures forevermore. In the presence of God there is fullness of joy. At his right hand there are pleasures forevermore. If there is fullness of God in the presence of God, and it is true, the Bible says that God dwells in you. The presence of God resides inside you. In fact, you are the house of God. God lives inside you. God lives inside you. Now, if God lives inside you, and in his presence there is fullness of joy, that means that since God is living inside you, joy is inside you. Now, if joy is inside you, the Bible says rejoice. That means that you should respond to this joy that is inside you. Yeah, that is why the Bible does not say you should be happy. But it says you should rejoice. Because it knows that if it says you should be happy, happiness hap you know, takes place when something happens. If, if I give you one million dollars, you will be happy. Why? Because something has happened. Something good has happened. So it brings to your heart happiness. And that is different from joy. Joy is something that is on the inside of you. It doesn't matter whether you have anything happens. It doesn't matter whether you receive a gift or anything good or bad happens. It's something that is there. It's from God. It is joy from God. And that's why you see some people, they are, it seems as if they are losing, and yet they are happy. It seems as if something terrible is happening to them, and yet they show joy. You see, you cannot see them discomforted. You cannot see them sad. They are always beaming with joy, because there is something inside them that is more than, that, that shows them that they are more than what they are going through. It is this joy of the Lord that I'm talking about. When the joy of the Lord is inside a man, no matter how bad the thing that happened, no matter how bad it is that happens to him, that thing inside him will be pushing him. That thing inside him will make him to rejoice. We make him not to even feel it. It is the joy of the Lord. It happens only to those who know the Lord. Do you know the Lord? You are always sad because you don't know the Lord. If you give your life to Jesus Christ today as your Lord and Savior, that joy I'm talking about will be there. And it doesn't matter what happens. It doesn't matter what goes on in your environment. That joy will well up from the inside of you. The Bible says that those that believe in him, in me, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. You see, it flows out of you, out of your belly, because you know the Lord, because the Lord loves you, because you care to, 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 to tap into God. You can never be sad. You can never be at a disadvantage. You can never be disadvantaged because God, the creator of the heavens and the earth, your maker is living inside you and he will never allow you to suffer. He said, he shall never leave you nor forsake you. So when the joy, when you are a child of God, the joy of God is inside you. All you need to do is to respond to that joy. Don't respond to the happenings. Respond to the joy inside you. Don't respond to what you are going through. Respond to what is inside you, which is God. God bless you. Thanks for listening. Once again, my name is Sunday Joseph Adenuga. I'll come to you again with more word from the Lord. It is well with your soul. You can mail me at sourcesdimensionchurch at gmail.com or get to my website at www.motivationfortoday.com. You can send donations to me. My name is Sunday Joseph Adenuga. You can use wire, wire transfer. 
or you can write check to me. My address is G um, Sunny Day, I mean Success Dimension Church, located at Sunny Day Model School, okay, to know Ibadan. God bless you. It is well with you. In Jesus' name. Amen.